Okay, so the first card that came out is eating a banana in reverse. So someone may be lacking potassium or need to eat bananas um, or someone that um, likes to eat bananas um, thinks it's time to do something. They wish they could erase something um, that has happened. They feel like you are a goal, like they scored a goal with you. Someone um, could be watching you um, relax, doing things that you enjoy, and they could be um, the other um, two things that says is making yourself dizzy and a dog chasing its tail. So somebody watching you be happy could make them feel like they are chasing their own tail. Someone may be feeling restless at this time. Uh, boots, making a bed, telling a secret. So um, someone may be trying to keep a secret about whose bed their boots have been under, like the Shania Twain song says. <clears throat> um, someone wants to come back and burst your bubble and play like a piano, which is kind of... Um, I did a Secret Admirer um, reading yesterday, and these were the last two cards. It was a really good reading up until the end, and these last two cards came out. So this um, may be a continuation of that reading. So someone may be coming back. Someone thinks you have a beautiful smile. Um, someone has sounded the horn about something. Um, and the last thing that it says here is stringing beats. So maybe someone wanted to string you along. And um, they can't do that at this time. Okay, when I get the cat, um, I get female energy. Um, and then drinking a lot of water. And these came out sideways. So... Um, there may be a female that's drinking, um, they could be drinking water, um, they could be drinking anything at this time, but, um, it, maybe they're focused on their health at this time. Okay, we have a rabbit, so we know what the rabbit stands for. Um, I have to be cautious with my wording at this moment because they are kids in the vicinity um, within earshot so I have to be careful about what words I use but um, rabbits like to mate <laughs> okay so somebody is watching you and they are trying to figure out a way to spot your reputation at this time. And that is because they, um, people are seeing your strength and courage. I have polishing shoes here. So you may be um, uh, uh, very clean you take care of what you own. Um, even if you don't have much, you take care of what you do have. Okay, so we got some good cards coming out so far. Someone uh, thinks that you are one in a million, or even if someone else or nobody else thinks that you are one in a million, you are one of a kind, you have special gifts or talents, you are the boss, you um, have an air about you of leadership, and someone is having memories of you, or they are wanting you to have memories of them. Someone that you loved in the past, or well, it doesn't have to be in the past, but someone is having memories of you that involve love. So someone is thinking about you and love at this time. Something is going to be happening for you quick as lightning. So something is about to happen very rapidly for you. Um, team player came out, so I feel like maybe a partnership could be coming, um, maybe a love offer is going to be happening, or somebody that wants to team up with you, but I feel like this is um, more of a relationship, not necessarily a business. Somebody is seeing that you are the real deal, you are not fake, whatever you do, um, you uh, do it with integrity.
Count your blessings. You are someone who is grateful for whatever you have. You take care of your things. Um, you feel blessed no matter what you have. So even if you don't have a lot, you are always grateful and you have an attitude of um, gratitude. There may be someone in your energy that is all talk and no action at this time. So someone may be um, talking a lot about you at this time um, and they are hitting the panic button. So there's someone that likes to talk about you um, and it could be in a negative way, but um, whatever they're talking about, they're hitting the panic button. So they may be, um, I'm getting projection. Um, so someone is trying to take the focus off themselves by talking about you because they're panicking about something. <clears throat> so someone this is better safe than sorry in the reverse so somebody did not err on the side of caution they did something without thinking about it and it was to add insult to injury regarding you so you are taking something up to the next level you are elevating in life and somebody is trying to cause insult or injury to that somebody does not want you to elevate or be seen in a positive light and this is green-eyed monster and kettle of fish so this may be um a group of people it could be women um but there is a group of people um kettle of fish so that that could be a school of fish um and they are envious of you or were envious of you green-eyed monster so somebody was jealous of you you are going to get your happily ever after so um, what I'm getting so far is um, there is somebody coming towards you with a love offer. They see your strength. They think you have a beautiful smile. And there is somebody who um, wants to team up with you. But we have somebody, um, and they see you as the real deal. They see that you um, you are a leader um, in an alpha female, maybe, and um, or male, take it how it resonates. But someone is hitting the panic button. They they don't want you to get your happily ever after, and they're coming in to insult and add injury to something. So you are weathering the storm in place for the other team. So what I'm getting from this is um, you have opposition going on currently. Someone is trying to um, make you look like you are not what you are or... Um, they're spreading a false narrative about you. Someone is your enemy, someone is your opposition, and you're weathering the storm. You're trying to get through this. You're having to fight battles and defend yourself. You are taking control of your life. Take the tiger by its tail and badge of honor. You are an honor honorable person. Um, you, are, you possess integrity. Whatever you do, you do it with a cup of love, which I appreciate because that's what we're here for. Absence makes the heart grow fonder and by hook or crook. So someone that tried to steal something from you, um, absence makes the heart grow fonder. They wanted you to need them for something. So I think I feel like they wanted you to come back and beg them for something um, so that maybe they could look like they were a hero of some sort. Um, but they're trying to put you back at square one over and over again. And this is in the upright. So what I'm getting is this person who plays for the other team um, your opposition, someone who is opposing you, um, does not want you to succeed. They want to keep putting you back at square one. They don't want you to move forward with your life. And once again, that jealousy, that energy of jealousy is coming through so strongly. And the green-eyed monster already came out, so I know I'm on the right track here. The cards don't lie. The energies don't lie. The cards just read the energy. A better mouse trap. So they're trying to trap you up in something. And a perfect storm has been created, and this person is in hot water. So whoever is trying to trap you up, the better mouse trap, that person is being caught up in their own lies, their own deceit. Someone is being exposed for something. Um, they're being exposed as your op. Um, beggars can't be choosers. They want you begging. They want you homeless. They want you out on the street. 
um, you freed yourself from this person, free and easy, free and clear. So you may not be dealing with this person at this time. You laid down the law with them. You have set clear boundaries with this person, and that that pisses somebody off. Whether it's a male or female narc, narcs do not respect boundaries. Um, <clears throat> they think the laws do not apply to them, so um, that could be them. Um, okay, so I have the bottomless pit in reverse. So somebody was never satisfied with something. They um, were greedy. Whatever they got was never enough. Um, Hail Mary passed in reverse. Um, 11th hour, they didn't want you to be able to climb out of whatever trap was being set for you and don't step on anyone's toes and that's in the reverse. So whoever this was didn't care to step on your toes. They jumped into doing something with both feet and that was in the reverse. So whatever they did, um, they were dedicated to it, to it and they still are. They're, they're dedicated to making you look bad for some reason. And it's the blind leading the blind. So um, a kettle of fish came out. So there could be a small group of people, um, maybe even a larger group, but um, they were spreading misinformation or um, maybe even slander, lies, gossip. Um, but it's the blind leading the blind. Whoever this group was listening to did not know what they were talking about. So they were misinformed. And they went for broke with this. They didn't care um they contacted everybody that they could get a hold of anytime you showed one ounce of progressing this person found a way to interfere and jump in and trying to sabotage you a penny saved is a penny earned so you could be watching your finances at this moment you may not have a lot of money at this time um you are trying to work on saving money and this person um this jealous person that is coming up does not want you to be able to save money ace in the hole or up their sleeve um they felt like they had something up their sleeve maybe they felt like they had some um dirty secrets or something about you but whatever they have um it either isn't true or it is the old you whatever they're um talking about you like whatever they think they have up their sleeve it's not going to work out the way they think um they're getting caught up in their lies and slander now and um this person is being exposed for the um, person that they truly are, honestly. <clears throat> so you may be in isolation at this time. Um, maybe you are having trust issues, trusting people because they're, um, you could be aware of a group of people um, that just are trying to hurt you at this time and maybe you just need to recharge and heal yourself from something um this person this shows a crowd and someone trying to re remain hidden in the crowd so it's like you may be alone and isolated but there's someone who may be pretending that they still mess with you talk with you or deal with you someone is acting like they they know you or know about you and they're trying to keep their identity heal um hidden from people and they could be um connected to these two guys in reverse you do have a support group you do have a group of people that do want to work with you even though somebody wanted you isolated and didn't want you to be able to have help, you do have um, some help coming. And there are two guys. So um, these could be your friends. Um, it could even be family. But there are two guys in the upright who are part of this community. And maybe they've been helping you out in some way. Um, they may see you as resourceful. This person is milking the cow, but it is in the upright. So I'm going to pull a few more cards before I for sure get a better idea. Okay, so currently, <laughs> I 
someone has milked you dry. Um, you may be out of resources at the moment, but you um, are working on rebuilding yourself. Someone wanted you to not have anything sold out. They didn't want you to have any options whatsoever. So maybe somebody milked you dry um, financially. Okay, so there could be a few males out in the community. These two men are walking through a crowd and there is communication. So, um, <laughs> I, I know, I know what this is about. And, um, since it's my energy, so these, these males, these, um, gentlemen that may be helping you, there is a woman and, um, I'm going to say your mother, I'm getting a mother energy. Um, a jealous female is contacting it doesn't have to be but in my case um i i'm certain that's what this is about um there is a woman figure that is contacting these men she does not want them to help you out in any way she does not want anyone to help you out whatsoever so that the narrative that is being spun about you um gets seen the way she wants it to be seen so these these two gentlemen in reverse these could be your exes um the they could be someone that you were connected to in the past and they are currently helping you um they don't have to be the same exact person in the picture to mean that um to mean that it just there was just one picture in the reverse and there's this one lusty woman who came out later on so um maybe you were attracted um married to them when you were younger um, maybe it could have been even years ago, but you were connected to these two men in some way and now they may be currently helping you or they're friendly towards you. Um, they don't have animosity towards you like this female wants. Like this female is communicating something to them and she is trying to get them to see you in a different way, a different light. She is trying to make sure that you do not have any options. And I am going to pull a couple of these cards. Okay. How many what? Oh, subscribers? Two so far. <laughs> okay, sh 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 I'm still recording. Just let me finish, okay? <laughs> Just give me a minute, guys. We'll go outside in a minute. So right now you are seen as the queen of wands on the upright and someone wants to heal a heartbreak with you or you are healing from a heartbreak. So right now you are seen in this leadership position. Um, you are caring, loving, empathetic, and um, you're just a good person. So in the current energy, this came out sideways. So there is a union coming, a two of cups, and this is a divine union. Um, it fits in the upright um, or comes out sideways. I read this as someone, there's a divine union coming. So it could be a soulmate um, or a twin flame energy coming towards you. So I feel like there is a relationship on its way. This is sideways. So this is going to be happening in the near future. Yeah, see, I like that. You are going to get the offer you have been waiting for. If you have been waiting for the right person to show up, it is going to come. They may have been dealing, um, the person coming towards you um, may have been dealing with someone who they thought was their divine counterpart, but the star in reverse is like um, not a good person. It could be even evil, um, not the greatest person. So it could have been their false twin flame that they were involved in in the past. Maybe they had to sever ties with this person before they could come towards you. <clears throat> Your 
cycle of bad luck is over, the wheel of fortune in reverse. So the wheel of fortune has turned and whatever bad luck you may have been experiencing, that is over um, because that is followed by the death. So uh, this is over. Death card in the upright means new beginning. So this cycle is over and you are moving into a new cycle. A new cycle of good luck and good fortune. Okay, something is done. Something is over. Some Something did not go in somebody's favor. Um, if somebody was coming against you to try to interfere with your relationships, um, the sword also goes to truth. It could also be seen as a judgment. So someone could have gotten a judgment um, that did not go in their favor and it put an end to something. So that could mean that if you go to court, um, something could be final and put to rest so that it cannot come back to interfere with your life anymore. Um, especially if you do have um, someone who has been interfering in your life and causing turmoil or trouble, that is, that's over, that is ending. You are in a new cycle, a new beginning, and you're moving forward. Okay, so brain damage came out, but this could also mean mental stability. So um, someone um, may th um, be mentally unstable and wants to marry you, or maybe they could be mentally stable and wants to marry you, or maybe you have suffered brain damage. Um, slow news day, so um, someone could be waiting for communication from you, but you have not spoken to this person for a while and love like winter hey guys shh, shh. quiet down please for just a second um so love like winter someone views you as cold-hearted or there is someone cold-hearted okay so another thing that i could be getting is once these other cards came out so someone is breaking the silence silver and cold and howling at the moon so someone what i'm now getting now that the rest of the cards have flipped over someone that um is mentally unstable does not want to see you get married um they could be spreading news out into the community um you may not be dealing with this person you have not communicated with this person and they are a cold-hearted person love like winter and you are breaking the silence about how cold they were to you because silver and cold came out um again so cold cold like someone is very cold-hearted and you may be breaking the silence about this person and they are howling at the moon this is pissing this person off they are not happy um they wanted to throw rocks and hide their hands they didn't want to come out and be exposed for what they are doing um they don't want you to know that every time that you are involved with someone they try to contact this person um, that you end up being in a relationship with and starts bad mouthing you and telling them things that may not even be true. This, is, this could even be their own projections or things that you did like back when you were a teenager or something and you may be a grown woman now so they may not even have any basis for what they're saying. They're, gold on, they're going on old information. So this person wants to be a tribute. This person wants to copy you. They wish they could be you. They could be watching you. They could even be driving by your house or they could like um, a lot of drive through food. Maybe they don't cook a lot. They are very shallow, skin deep. So this person is only um, concerned this jealous energy. This is what I'm picking up. Um, we're, we're back to this jealous person. And I, I keep going back to this, this woman on the phone she really likes to talk she really likes to gossip she has nothing better to do she really likes to talk and for some reason you seem to be like the focus of her attention so that's also why i associate the tribute um this person is jealous tries to copy you like she wishes she could be you speak of the devil so this person is not a good person um, she tries to make you out to be like you are the devil. She may even call you satanic and you are following your heart. This person is unemotional, like toy, toy soldiers. Like if she was a mother figure, maybe she didn't show you any love or affection growing up. Um, 
So coming home and the whisper and somebody put something in my drink came out. So what I'm getting from this is maybe you went home and someone started whispering and spreading um, rumors and gossip that maybe you were a drug addict and somebody put something in your drink. So this female, maybe you stayed with her. If she was a mother figure, maybe you went home and she put something in your drink and then was telling people that you were on drugs to support her narrative because then she could get on the phone and she had something to talk about. It is what it is, the cards don't lie. And I know my own personal story and that is exactly what happened in my case. So um, the energy doesn't lie, folks. The truth comes out even in the cards. I mean, people try to hide the truth, but you know, So somebody was barking up the wrong tree. So um, when, okay, so someone was barking up the wrong tree and determined to work was in the reverse. So this person called you lazy. Um, they may have even called you a bum. Um, they slandered you. This, this person made up false narratives about you and they were barking up the wrong tree because that is not true. And they are getting caught up in their lies and that could land them in court. The court card came out. So the things that they did, um, the slander, the defamation of character, that stuff has criminal consequences in some cases. Something is a blessing in disguise and better late than never. So you do have something positive coming your way. Someone um, is sincere or they view you as sincere. And I feel like that is someone that's coming towards you. Someone may be coming towards you um, sincerely. And that is because they're pissed off. This person is finding out what is going on um, and they know you. So this person, you, the person coming towards you to maybe offer you your two of cups that maybe want to go into a relationship with you knows you. And they know you're a sincere person and whatever they're hearing, it is pissing them off. And that came out um, in my um, Wizard of Oz cards, I think yesterday, um, or the, um, either that one or the Secret Admirer one, where someone was hearing, it could be the Secret Admirer one, where someone is hearing something about you and they are pissed. Like they are so pissed because they know that it is not the truth about you. And it is really upsetting this person that people are believing what is being said about you because they know that you are not any of the things that are being said about you. And it is really upsetting this person. So you do have a, a divine counterpart who is really upset at the moment about what they're hearing about you. And it's not because they believe it. Um, this person wants to come in union with you and it's because they know that you are speaking the truth. And this came out sideways. So this is current this is going on currently someone's playing with fire and they have an axe to grind against you so whoever is um this this female energy they have an axe to grind like i seriously i i can't figure out for the life of me yeah. what this um female energy like i i don't know she needs to find something better to do but she's holding on to something like I have no idea what it is, but she has a grudge against you from the past, and she is holding on to that for dear life. Like, seriously. Um, <laughs> if the shoe fits in reverse. So, this person created a narrative. She even um, did things purposefully to um, make it look like what she was saying was true about you. She was throwing rocks and hiding her hands causing events to happen so that it looked like it was true but this is in reverse the shoe didn't fit it doesn't fit the narrative which is why this person that wants to come towards you is pissed off because they know that the the person spreading the lies and the rumors are as dull as dishwater and so they may not um be um the smartest person the brightest crayon in the box um so yeah. Something was all for show. Dog and pony show. Someone put on a show and that came out with the shoe, if the shoe fits. So someone really, really put on a show to make their narrative fit. Like someone was dedicated to this and these came out sideways. So we have fit to be tied 
eating your words and the luck of the Irish. So right now, currently, you have the luck of the Irish. You are lucky. And someone is having to eat their words and they are fit to be tied. Like this, there is someone, this, this jealous woman that keeps coming out. I just, it keeps coming back to this woman. She could be the ringleader behind all of this. I mean, if she's contacting your exes and spinning this narrative, um, they're having to eat their words, and this is causing them to be to be fit to be tied, which um, is really making this person just work even harder to come against you. So, um, let's see. I might just do. I don't know. I feel like that's kind of it. Like. This, this is going on currently, like, this person is pissed off, um, my cup of love, cup of wisdom, final thought is, um, be cautious of people, um, be careful what you believe, especially when you hear people speaking about other people, um, don't always believe what you hear, um, because uh, there are people out in the community getting really, really pissed off and upset about what they're hearing. And it's actually not because they're believing it. There may be a group of people that have believed this stuff for so long, but there, there's a group of people. If we go back to my Woodstock cards, there is a group that want to help you build and move forward. They don't want to see you stuck, but this, this woman, she really is dedicated to keeping you from not moving forward, and it keeps coming out over and over, and I just read the energy, and since um, this person is in my energy, I'm picking up on that, and so do the cards, and this person, what they did... Um, it says it right here, they were barking up the wrong tree. They lied, they called you lazy. Um, they said you were not determined to work, um, that you were not a good worker, and that's not true. These were in the reverse, and this is going to put them in court. This person is dead set um, on hurting you, and they have a vendetta against you. And this is really starting to upset some people out in the community because they may be tired of hearing about it. So my final words of wisdom is be careful what you speak on other people or about other people, especially if it's not true. Um, things will always come back to you and people will eventually see who you are when the mask falls off. Hey folks, I hope this helps. Have a good day.